Hello and welcome to uh, sort of an announcement. It's not really a Zcast, even though we have the graphics up there. It's the announcement for the coach tryouts and the masterless discussions. Uh, we felt that we needed to make a video about our decisions, and we we've discussed a lot of this through the the couple of weeks or the few weeks that we've had. So, uh, but. To be fair, a lot of the things like the master list, we haven't actually come together and made a decision. Yeah, we haven't yet. Yeah, it's all been self. It, it's self. By the way, uh, hi, yeah. hi everyone. Uh, the whole three. staff is here more or less. Drangel though is really sick, so he's kind of yeah. just texting it. <laughs> yeah, he's muted and texting. Yes, but uh, let's go around real quick, just for people that don't know our voices for some reason. I'm Burn. Uh, yep. I I'm, I'm the. General admin, we have Kyo, as you just said. And I am the horrible thing that sleeps under your bed. Squee. <laughs> Esquire. Yes. <laughs> and we're also joined I'm by the... Orange. I'm Orange. Hey. Hello. I'm a, I'm a guy. I, I do stuff sometimes. He's all... Lies! He, he's Lies! Our, our main modder. And. Yay also the commissioner for the sister league of naruto league <gasps> you mentioned me yeah all right i mean that's we mentioned bucks. you last time too <laughs> damn it that's five bucks every mention five bucks. Shit. yeah you owe us 50 bucks so anyway i'm hungry <laughs> God. Guys, every year we're uh, out of Texas. So, what? Yeah. so so uh, because it's like twelve forty two AM, yeah. let's uh let's run down actually it's one forty two for you two. Uh let's run down with quick how oh, this no, is also go. twelve for me. Not um many. we 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 want to discuss first I think first we're gonna discuss the coaching applications, okay. then we're gonna run down the master list, then I forgot. I'm sorry. I can only then, keep like two things in my mind at any one time. And then time. we have a special announcement. At yes. The end. Then we have a special announcement at the end. So, um, uh, first things first, you guys, we just want to jump straight into this because the biggest okay. thing and the thing that might require the most explanation is what we're starting with. Yeah. Yes. So, uh, uh, the coaching applications. We had five positions up for coaching uh, positions. Yes, I just said that twice. The, yes. And we received a total of two applications. Um, we looked over these applications thoroughly, and uh, we all agree that they are decent applications. They, two things. One, they technically wouldn't work. Uh, what would, would be the word for it? They would be uh, disqualified, because both of them actually don't quite follow the standards set out to fill out an application. Um, I don't want to go into the details. It's not our, our goal here to publicly say this is wrong, this is wrong. What we will say is that we liked them overall. They were they were good applications. Um, they would be in a, a world with many more people disqualified or, or redone. Um, but the big thing to point out here is that, like I said before, we received a total of two applications for five coaching positions. That's a big problem. Um, and the honest truth is what we're going to do for now, because we don't want to, um, and I hope this is not you, I hope you all understand the point of this. We're not going to name them coaches because we feel like we wouldn't be naming it because they're the best applications. We'd be naming them because they're the only applications and that's not a good thing to do. Maybe if we have to, we will, but what we want to do instead is we want to rehold the tryouts uh, probably after Christmas, sometime early in the new year, after we've had some time to promote the league, which is what we're going to start doing now. We're going to start working on ways of promoting the league, getting our name out there, getting more people to join, getting more notice so that maybe we actually have at least five applications yeah. for, for five positions, hopefully more than one application for each position um, so that we can actually make uh, um uh good choices um and and those two who did submit it uh we strongly encourage you to just resubmit your applications uh by all means pm us if you'd like to to go over what you know what you you, you missed or whatnot and then just resubmit your applications they're really good applications um we yeah, just, just want minor stuff we just want to be able to actually have um 
uh, like I said, we want to choose people because of the best, not because they're the only ones. Um, so hopefully you understand that we'll redo it sometime early next year. Hopefully we'll have more people participating then. And, um, you know, we wish you the best of luck then. I, I really think that, like I said, PMS, we're here to help. We'll let you know exactly what was missing, uh, so to speak, and, and so what you can do for better and just resubmit. But uh, that's the big one. And that's going to be the one that's probably going to be a little contentious. I understand there might be some upset people as always. Uh, you are more than welcome to PM me. And and look, the honest truth is, Burn and KO have to deal with a lot of moderation. So in this regard, do them a favor, PM me. I will be more than happy to talk to anyone about it. Um, His Discord tag is... I'm just kidding. <laughs> you can well, join... You can find him on our, uh, our on Discord. My, the Discord server, yeah. My, my, my PMs aren't closed. Anyone can always PM me. So, um, so yeah. yeah. On to the next thing. <laughs> yes. That, you want me to thing. take over here? Yes. And I do, like I said, I want to stress before, this is actually going to be, we thought it would be best not to um, make hard decisions until this video so that you can actually see that we're not just ignoring you. We're actually going to, like, I have no idea. Uh, well, I know how Burn feels about one thing. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you all. But I don't we'll know, get to that. In a bit. Yeah, I don't. I don't know what what my, what my compadres are going to to vote one way or the other. And we felt that was kind of important to do on the video so that you can see that we're not taking we're taking everyone seriously. Yeah, yeah. We uh for for just to make this a little more streamlined, we did have each each other look at them on our own. So oh yeah, we've read them all. This. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, but this and, is our first time discussing them together. And I'd like to think that everyone has my opinion because it's right. But um, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> history, this history, is not history gonna has be... told me that's not the case. <laughs> right. I, I might fail this test. <laughs> <laughs> so um, yeah, this this isn't going to be like a Zcast thing where we read people's yeah. entire posts out. No, we're no. That's not yeah. going to happen. Yeah, if you'd yeah. like to, if you'd like to see the very well thought out uh, essays. Yes, essays. Uh, no, the, the we'll have a well link in the description, I think. Probably. Yeah, we'll do something like that. Yeah, um, sure. But yeah, please feel free to read them as you go along with this, and uh, let's let's jump right into it. All right. Uh, our first master list suggestion was to put O'Reilly on a Dragon Ball Warriors master list. Um. All right. This was actually. Let, let, let me get let me get my opinion out first of all. Um, I do know for a fact that that's during the era of Dragon Ball. I never really watched Dragon Ball, but I do know that it's a crossover. But I, I'm, I'm gonna let you guys figure this out. I, I seriously do not care. <laughs> Burns' official opinion is, <laughs> <laughs> um. I, I will say, I don't know about you guys, but I did actually a lot of research on this one, as in I watched the episodes. Um, the episodes are actually from the canon uh, list of episodes for Dragon Ball Warrior. Oh, Dragon Ball. Jesus, Dragon Ball Warriors. Warriors. It, it's from the canon list of episodes. Yes. And um, it, it wasn't so much like a, hey, if you watch this, you'll love Dr. Slump type of thing. It felt a yeah. little more natural. And yeah. Actually, fun fact: uh, the ultimate that uh, Je that General Blue has in this game, it actually comes from one of these episodes. Yeah. It's also, a also, there is saying that. that she comes back in Super. So, yes. So this she is also true. Yes. Um, uh, I, all right. <laughs> Go I ahead, did you first. watch the show, um, Dragon Ball. I it was a few years ago now, but I watched through all of it um it, i did skip some non-canon stuff so i can definitely tell you that kaya was right these episodes are canon because i went by a list at the time and i i saw these episodes uh she's definitely in the show not you know for a huge portion of it mind you but she's in it and they're they're it's canon material so she i obviously you know, even though I'm currently the coach of the team, uh, 
you know, I, I'm going to probably that's say yes regardless. Saying, <laughs> I was going to say, and that's why he's saying no. Yeah. <laughs> Just bait and switch him. But yeah. Um, I, I'd cool. have to say that um, I, I, I don't think we're ever going to see her move teams, but that's not what we base no, these decisions yeah. on. Yeah. Um, yeah, we should never base our decisions right. around, oh, it's okay. That'll I be just fine. They'll never yeah. drop that because there is that slim possibility <laughs> that exactly. somewhere down the line, yeah, we we shouldn't do that. I, I just want to point out at the start that that uh, um, that exactly that those aren't reasons why we choose this. But if you are on uh, Dragon Ball Warriors, don't get your hopes up anytime soon. I, yeah. I think the Vals have her on lock. Um, Trust me, we're said, familiar with other teams having. I mean, their and they're going to have to compete teams. with androids too. <laughs> that yeah. said she's on dragon ball i've seen the episodes it's been a while but i have seen the episodes they're not filler she's on dragon ball that fits the master list i see no reason not to add her honestly yep yeah i don't think i officially said it but i i'm totally okay with her uh on dragon ball warriors as well and uh derangel uh, derangel like... stop stop cussing like that stop it <laughs> That's inappropriate. Oh, stop it. He's not doing anything like that. <laughs> He's not so even I... typing right now. No, he's I not. Believe... I'm the one typing. So I believe that is four yeses Jeez. and one yeah. Yeah, one yeah. One I... <laughs> the, so, the eyes have yeah. it. So, sure. So a really, a really it will be added to Dragon Ball Warriors Master List. Yeah. Correct. All right. Uh, next one. Uh, first form Zarbon, Derp's master list. Uh, so oh, should I go first on this one? Yeah, we'll take turns. Who goes first? Yeah. So here's the thing. Um, I, I'm gonna have to be a pretty strong no on this one. The first one, my first instinct is like, what are they talking about? He's not even. First form, even if we take out second form and just consider first form, he was shown to be menacing and powerful and slaughtered many Namekians. And you could say mm -hmm. the same thing about Dodoria, except Dodoria's death and, and everything that Dodoria did with Krillin and Vegeta was so embarrassing and yeah. humiliating <laughs> that Zarbon, I don't feel, had the same thing. And Zarbon again, I, I, in a cool way. At well, least. Uh, well. Well, if we're talking only about first form, I know that's subjective. Some people could look at first form versus Vegeta and say that was just as humiliating. I, I think that's a hard sell. Yeah. Um, but I get that. The, my big thing is this. We very rarely, and for only for really good reason, do we split transformations. Usually it's the whole package. You take the whole character or none of the character. Yeah. There's maybe a handful of people like say a man um or majub who we split and put it on a different team and those are almost always because that team really really needed the people like the majins or because in the case of say man it's obviously a completely different type of character personality everything in fact that's the whole point he's trying to pretend he's not gohan mm -hmm. um so i really don't feel comfortable at all trying to say now anyone that has a transformation like for example can all the different freezes now be considered independently i don't like that idea i think that's yeah. a line i really don't want to cross yeah, yeah. because I... there are characters where each transformation they're just the same character cell in every form is still cell it's right. not yeah like you said say a man and adult gohan where they feel and act like two totally different characters and i i want to say people. something really quick because i know i can feel people i can <laughs> feel them um getting well what about the super saiyans man you you split up the super saiyans that's because we needed characters to fill out the free agent pool number right. one and yes. number two those those forms were never going to be achieved, except if they de uh, uh, de ah uh, de transformed. De transformed, yeah. If they unless they de transformed, reverted, which super, I think is yeah, reverted. Reverse that's the that's that's the word I was looking for. But su the Super Saiyans, the team, never really did that. Like there were maybe once or twice in several seasons that that happened, 
So yeah. we were perfectly fine with using them. And it's then also part of the reason we ended up retiring them too was because it made that stuff kind of complicated. Yeah. It, that, but, that's another reason I, why they, they they aren't still split up is because when we retired the Super Saiyans, they're they're now just one solid character again. Yeah, the full package. Um, and then, but like I said, that's still a um, uh, a valid concern of even with the Super Saiyans, we had a very good reason to do it that wasn't just we wanted to split them up. At the time, our free agent pool was severely lacking. And in order for it to be strong, and and I'm going to get to this later too, I think. I, I don't know if you guys will have the same opinions, but our free agent pool needed to be um, viable. It needed to be something people could take seriously. So we needed good players to throw in it. That's why we split the Super Saiyans versus, you know, the like that. I, I don't want to also cross the line and then just say every character out there can be independently uh, um taken by their transformation i'm not to mention that's going to cause a lot of uh trouble for teams like for example if you're uh, afterlife you know what happens if you're not sure what transformation you're going to take what if you don't know until the end of the preseason if you want form one or form two and is that fair to uh derp then who has to sit there and wait till the end of the preseason know if they can have form ones i just don't want that to be an issue uh, as much as we can i'd rather the it's a whole package deal or not yeah, and then I I know the the idea of um, declaring which forms early so that we can split them has come up, but still, it's it's an iffy thing that we're not comfortable with for the most part. And I can I'll be honest and say I see both sides of that idea. I can see the benefits and I can also see the potential downsides, but I just don't think that we're in a place where we're ready to make a step like that. Like, even if we were to consider it, I think, you know, the way that we have it right now, I think it's fine. Um, well, we, we also have need to consider. To be very have... clear. I was going to say, we also need to be very clear that there will be, this is it. We're, we're yeah. making final decisions. So I don't yeah, think we're exactly. ever going to be. <laughs> yeah. We're, we're not going to be coming back. Yeah. Yeah. If, if this sure. was like, yeah. 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 If this oh, was see, like see. a, uh, you know, if this was a decision that we were going to look at again later, then, you know, we wouldn't be making this video. But, <laughs> um, you know, I, I, I just want to address those people that had that idea because it, it was brought up to me a while back. And I just want to say sure. I, can, I can hear both sides of it. And, you know, this the point of this video is not to denounce ideas. It's not to shut people down it's to try to explain where we're coming from yeah um so i hope that this is has achieved that um so and of course as we said earlier if you want to talk about it more you can always dm one of us or PM. yeah yeah uh so are we all in agreement no to the zarbon first form on dirt yeah, yeah no, no no to zarbon i'm right. i'm perfect i'm very uncomfortable with splitting him and so is dar all right. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. So, just a little pre-emphasis on this one. All right. So here's the one that <laughs> yeah. I hate. So hold, hold, on, hold, on, hold on. So <laughs> when this one came in, we were already in a call. So this one, this was the only one where we had a little bit of pre-existing conversation. I, I really want to uh, to take that snippet from the staff chat and throw that in there where I. I was making my own gang war memes all to annoy oh. burn. Can, can I take can I take the lead on this one? Because yes, by all means. <laughs> all right. Go ahead, Kai. So I probably did the most research on Android 16 for Earth Defender. Uh, there were there were a lot of good points brought up in the post about how Hercule was on there because he attacked Cell and 16, you know, put his life on the line to try to save the Earth from Cell. And he also gave the big speech to Gohan to make him go Super Saiyan 2 and save the world, and yada, yada, yada. The big thing that really pushed it over the edge, though, because I was watching videos of, the, of that Cell Saga scene with the Cell games, and 16 has a Capsule Core sticker <laughs> on his chest, which to me signifies that it that he had 
joined their team. It was a cheap sticker, and it looks really flimsy, but it's still <laughs> a sticker with the Capsicore logo. I hate you, Kyle. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I had a lot of fun making meme pictures with that. Yeah, that was so Here's the thing. Here's the thing. To poor Burns' credit, he was he he doesn't like the idea. I'm sure he still doesn't like the idea, but that was the final straw. That was what made him throw his hands up and go, I guess. I guess. <laughs> yeah, he literally did that on call. It was, it he was, was actually just like, I guess. It wasn't it <laughs> wasn't well placed arguments. It wasn't reason logic. It was that damn capsule course sticker. <laughs> and really, a- after we saw that, um, you know, it's it's a case of <laughs> Pretty much, so, you know, so, we we're just like, so, all right. <laughs> I think that um, we we are going to say yes to Android sixteen being on Earth Defenders. I I can't, in all con- good consciousness, say that he never defended the Earth against <laughs> threats of evil. So I can. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm also for Android sixteen and a sticker. <laughs> so i think that's it yeah so uh what about you uh, darky we need to actually say oh yeah no i said same here i also agree yeah. um even before the sticker i could see the argument <laughs> sure sure yeah the sticker just pushed it over the edge yeah yeah that was like I'll the final nail on the, the coffin even, even for burn that was yeah. and derangel as well Yes. Yes. So. so 16 is now on the master list for the Earth Defenders. Yes. Yay. Yay. Yeah. Um, and moving right. on. Yes. <laughs> moving on to one that has been topic of of the Discord for a while now. Super 17 on the Androids master list. <sighs> Who wants to take this one? Well, okay. You want to go first, Squee? Well, I, I don't think there's going to be a whole lot of conversation here. Because no. He's a, a free agent only character. We, oh, yeah. we, we, maybe, maybe there should be some conversation as to why, because maybe it helps to explain ourselves. We made a rule um, that many of the banned, previously banned characters like Super 17, like Sin, uh, are free agent only. Um, and they will not be allowed to be on other teams. Now, not all the free agents are like this, but a lot of them are. And there's a very good reason for this. If we allowed, if we did not have any free agent specific uh, players, if we didn't have the ability to say this person is a free agent, and only a free agent, then in three seasons, all the teams would snipe everyone that's good out of the free agents. The second they have a good season, a team that has that theme would snipe them. I mean, why wouldn't you? It would just make yeah. sense. So the fear is that in three seasons, the free agent list is going to be nothing but the worst players. It's going to be a joke. And it's going to be something that no one cares about. And the free agent needs to be something players care about because it's so helpful to some teams. So yeah. we need to have some ringers, some good characters, some characters that are average to good that can only ever be gotten on the free agent list yes and uh that was the intention i just want to make that clear it was the intention from the moment that i started modding the characters to have them be free agent only um and this is exactly you know to go back a few steps to what we were discussing earlier you know um if what squeeze said happens because you know most of these characters if not all of them could have a theme applied to them um because you know the the reasoning in this post is sound but we have the rule there for a reason and that is if that if teams were to pick these characters up we would devolve into the same problem we had three seasons ago where we you know at the time that's when we needed to split up forms because right. we just didn't have options. <clears throat> and uh, well, More to the point, we'd have the options, but they wouldn't be options anyone cares about. The bidding war would yeah. become a joke because there's no one good to get. They all have exactly. Gotten. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, nah, so... man. Hit up my boy <laughs> fucking Kui, man. You got it. <laughs> and, and for that reason, I didn't nerf them 
too hard. Like I still, the intention was to make them less ridiculous and OP, but to still make them strong characters. Right. Yeah. Um, the characters that are worth the, you know, the Zenny that you spend on them. I mean, look at like Vegito, look at, uh, the work that, I mean, even, even super 17, he had some nice performances yeah. later into the season and go um, and go. Yeah. Like, you know, these characters are desirable. They're valuable. And especially for teams, you know, the, the way that that mechanic works is if you do bad in one season, you know, you have more Zenny than other teams and you can spend it on better free agents. And then if you that character happens to carry your team through a season or really help you, then, you know, if you have a good record, you might not, you know, you might not be able to just get the same free agent that's really good over and over. So it's like a self kind of balancing system in a way. Yeah. Um, and I feel like that would just throw it out of whack if all the free agents were taken. <laughs> so yeah. long winded yeah. point is that, yeah, they're all of the characters that we added last season are staying free agents for that reason. So. And, yeah. And I just want to say two quick things. Uh, one, it, it, I just, I do want to reiterate that this was a really well thought out post. Uh, yes. Link. And, it, you know, it, it, we, we, we've read it very carefully. Right. Um, Your reasoning was very sound, but yeah. for other reasons, we still have to say no. Yeah. I, and, I don't want to speak for everybody, but I'm pretty sure we all agree that, you know, he would, he would be a nice fit if not for the rule that we have. Well, right. it's also a fusion. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. there's that too. Yeah. Not in the game, but in in canon of the non-canon story, he is. A yes, <laughs> in the canon of the non-canon. Yes, indeed. So there's also that. And guess oh, what? Wow. We saw him with the Capsule Corp logo. So he's going on <laughs> ED. It's all. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think that was photoshopped, buddy. That I, was photoshopped I... by Kayo, and he kept oh, man, pinging me with it. <laughs> To be fair, that Photoshop look a lot more convincing than the actual sticker sixteen had slapped on him. It's true. Now I need to do a mod like a, a skin no, no, for him that no, has... mm -mm. Oh my God. Mm -mm. no, 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 no. You are running Literally every single this... mod by us beforehand, sir. Okay, all right. Uh, Freeze um, is now on the Masterless Ferris Defenders. I saw a capsule corner under his foot. <laughs> I mean, he did technically, as a cyborg, kill a oh. Freeze that was going to attack. Earth, so you know <laughs> don't um, don't start because people could start bringing up super and i don't want to go into that well, they can't. please they can't because this is it um is, is that um we have to keep super on the free agent list for now i mean forever yes. yeah for, forever for what, now what do you mean, ever. What do you mean super for uh, I'm, not super talking about, I'm not talking not about super 17. 17 you guys were talking about frieza i know what you meant yeah yeah. Okay, oh, that's um, another thing too is if yeah, I mean I know this is the final discussion, but we don't want to use Dragon Ball Super as reasoning for Masterless because I don't know if you guys noticed, but this is a Dragon Ball Z game, not a Dragon yeah. Ball Super game. Correct. Yeah. And GT, but And G yeah, well, GT, but you know. <laughs> well, it's uh, in the GT is in the game at least. Yeah, so. yeah that's what I mean. Uh, yeah. But yeah, okay, so I think everyone, including Durr, is saying seven, Super 17 is going to stay as a free agent only. Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, that brings us on to our second to last uh, one, which is Sin uh, talking about changing the Ginyu Force to the Frieza Force uh, and adding characters like Apul, Kui, Frieza Soldier, and Zarbon Dodoria. But that's not so. That's not that's okay. Not what this is for? Um, I I can see why. You know, I, I've heard this idea come up multiple times over the course of you know several seasons. I get it. You know, you guys, you want the team to have an expanded roster. Um, it does suck when teams are stuck with literally just the five characters that they have however 
Um, you know, that was one of the main reasons that the free agent system was implemented was it, you, we can help teams like this. Um, and I know that that answer isn't necessarily going to satisfy a lot of people. I, I understand that completely. It's just that um, for me personally, I think that compromising the theme, because you guys are in agreement, right? It is a weaker theme. Much than- weaker. Yeah. Yes. That would be, you're taking the most famous group in Dragon Ball Z, the Ginyu Force, and you're turning them into Frieza soldiers, which is something that no one remembers. Yeah, and it's not as catchy. They don't have a theme right. song. Like, <laughs> here's the thing: as a staff, and and we always encourage you guys to do this as as well. But I know it's easy to lose sight. As a staff, we have to worry about or consider those people who just enjoy watching as well as partic- uh, participating, and anyone who watches dbz league and go ginyu force i like the ginyu force oh man remember ginyu oh that was so cool they see a team that says freeze the soldiers and they're gonna be like so like i mean is that who who's is that Kui? yeah <laughs> yeah oh it's part of the ginyu force. why don't they just call it the ginyu you know what, you see what i'm saying so i don't i think that that weakens the theme of that team to the point where i just would not do it it's too diluted it's yeah. it's like the i it's like the reason that we ended up limiting the the Earth Defenders roster is because if we were to let every single character, you know, every single variation of every single character on that team, not only would the master list be massive, no, oh, yeah, but the the theme is weakened, you know, um, and that wouldn't really happen in the case of this team being completely massive. I mean, but the theme would be. I feel like even weaker than if, than in the case of Earth Defenders, if we were to, do, you know, expand theirs. Um, yeah. So, you know, I get the reasoning behind it. Having more characters would be nice, but squeeze right. You know, we need to think about the viewers because, in the end, you know, the viewers are relevant too. Um, they matter, and. It's it's important for everyone to be able to enjoy the league. And I do want to point out that um, while, again, we're taking this seriously, this was a forum to argue people on the master list, not argue oh, theme yeah. changes theme. for teams. Yeah. Right. But it's nice to, it's nice to be able to address it, at least. Yeah. Um, yeah, of course. It and has then... popped up over the course of several seasons. Right. And also just real quick i know it wasn't brought up here but i've seen it in the uh discord about the neo ginyu force that had napa on oh, it oh yes that nope. was a xenoverse one or two alternate i think it was one plot line. But yeah yeah either yeah, way it was an alternate plot line in a game yeah we're not doing what ifs from other video games otherwise we increase the margins masterless so nicely right um but yeah, no, we're 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 just doing the anime and the manga. We're not we're not doing what if storylines from video <laughs> games. Yeah, I, you know it's it's the same thing with the super arguments. Yeah, like, exactly. Yeah, like I I know it wasn't here, but I just wanted to show that we we've, we've been reading, we've been watching, and listening and stuff. It's it's not all a vacuum that doesn't get seen. Right. Yeah. And we took a we took a like a solid week to look over this or, or more actually, but yeah, all of us individually, yeah, yeah. So it's it's not as if we're just we came up with this like two hours ago and we're like, yeah, let's do it. Yeah. So I think we're all in agreement not to change Ginyu Force's theme. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, I mean, if if it if it allowed them access to amazing characters, maybe it's a stronger argument. But I mean, it's just not worth changing the theme to get Frieza's soldier and Kui. Yeah, so. like, at that point, do you really? Like... I mean, a pool, maybe a pool. No, <laughs> maybe maybe a pool. But at that point, you know, you can get him as a free agent. Yeah, right. And the Saiyans just make that even more muddled if you include Nappa, Fasha, and Raditz. Yeah. Oh god, right. Yeah, so no. <laughs> yeah. No to that one, I'm afraid. Yep. And then that brings us to the final one. 
uh, freeze a soldier to the Ginyu Force Master List. Which is like kind of the same thing. It, mm-hmm. Yeah, kind of, without changing the theme. Well, my yeah. thought my thought would be is that uh, if we're not assuming changing the theme, which they never mentioned in the post of changing the theme in that post, yeah. um, right. my point is simply that he was never on the Ginyu Force ever. Yeah, the Ginyu Force was those five characters. Like, that was it. And, and the post goes on, it does, does discuss how they held tryouts, and that's true, Mm-hmm. But if you also recall, they spent most of the time talking about how these guys weren't good enough <laughs> to yeah. be on the Ginyu Force. So not only were they never on the Ginyu Force, they were at best trying out for the Ginyu Force. It was clear that they were not Ginyu Force material. Yeah, the Ginyu Force is was supposed to be like an elite squad. Like right. you don't you don't go to a football team tryout, fail the tryout, and say, Oh yeah, I'm on that team. Because I went to the tryout. Like, that's not how that works. Yeah. So, you know, I, again, I respect wanting to help you out. Know, the help out. Yeah. Because they are, they did have a really rough season and they've historically had some rough seasons, but it's just not a strong enough argument. You know, yeah. it's it's not there. Agreed. Unless I, I you guys agree. find like, oh, there was a hidden sixth Ginyu Force member no, that was like no. in one panel, but that's not a thing. <laughs> so let's not and, even uh, open up because this is the last <laughs> time we're talking about this. Let's I not know. open that door. And if that were I'll, a thing, I'll... we would have found it ourselves. Yeah. So yeah, um, so I, I mean, we're... Kyle found the capsule cork. <laughs> Yeah. Like yeah, we we have done research on this on both sides. Like I I was the reason Android team is in because I found extra information. I swear so we're, God, if you bring it up, all right, more. <laughs> let's let's rub it in more. <laughs> um. So I think we're all in agreement. Yeah, yeah. we are. Okay. And then uh, Durr also agrees. Mm-hmm. Um. And then before we go on to the big announcement. This I just want to reiterate because I know I've mentioned it multiple times in the Discord. Uh this is this was it for Masterless mm. discussion. We are right not going to consider any more Masterless suggestions. There, we're not adding any more characters to the league. So yeah. we feel like there is no more arguments to be made. Really. Yeah. So if you, not. if you like had an idea and you didn't post it. I'm sorry, but that's that's on you. Like you just this Ver- was verily I say unto thee, your time is up. Yeah. Yeah. So sorry if you missed it, but and then... and if if it needs to be said, because maybe uh, who knows how long into the future you're watching this video. The reasoning for that is we've been we're nine seasons in, starting season ten in six months, and conversations about the master list have constantly come up and been very very contentious we Sometimes need to good. just put an into it we needed to do so we gave everyone the chance here's your moment here's like a month make your arguments we will listen and as you saw we did yeah. and um actually added more people than i really thought we would have um yeah. or made more changes i mean than i really thought yeah. we would have but um this has to be it there from now on if you come up with an argument, oh well, the master lists are the master lists. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, this will go on for eternity. Yeah. We we have to kind of put our foot down at some point. And honestly, I think at this point, it, it, we, we've got it so good that any argument that would ever come up would be such a technicality and minor thing that it's not worth the argument. Yeah. yeah. Yep. So, just wanted to reiterate that. But thank you for your submissions. Yes, yes. thank you very much Agreed. for all the very well thought out uh, posts and uh, discussions. Thank you for making me want to stab Kyle in the eyes. <laughs> uh, if it wasn't for this, I, it would have been something else. I say yeah. thank you as well. Yeah, because, I mean, I'm sorry, Burn, but it was pretty fun. It's been a fun <laughs> week. Now I get the rusty knife. Y'all can, like, relax <laughs> with them at least every once in a while. Jeez. Hey, I haven't memed about it. I want squeak dead. 
I want his memes it. dead. Ninety percent me. <laughs> yeah, I know, but Squee popped in too. Yeah, he was. Yeah. Squee. I was squee. bored at work one morning. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think that brings us to our big announcements. Oh right. yeah. Ooh. Who wants to? Who wants to do the honors? Uh, Kyo, do you want to do it? You've kind of. Hey, guess what? We're going to again. YouTube. Ha! Oh, oh, that's Burns wow. That's yeah. not the big announcement, but that is an announcement. <laughs> Um, uh, I, I thought so that was as you guys are... <laughs> no oh <laughs> totally no big announcement yes yeah, you take over oh okay then i will take over gentlemen it's, um it's first and foremost as you as you all know um we uh um lost the tenkaichi bowl um yeah. because uh i didn't download it in time and twitch deleted it so i was unable to uh, upload it to youtube which is really really unfortunate and while that might change in the future um it, it's it, the simple truth is it's unfortunate and one of the things that people asked uh, rightly so was how are we going to fix this keep this from happening in the future and the honest truth is the best solution that we've had is we're going to move the league back to youtube uh twitch was interesting it was a nice experiment we thought about going there and then um seeing how that worked out for us but the honest truth is youtube is just far more convenient because it saves it forever and automatically and you can have it uh release the same day it takes a few hours to process it but other than that it, it just suits our needs much better i think so we're going to go back to youtube so this never happens again yeah and and with twitch i think it's like two weeks or something and then yeah, it's, it's gone only two weeks yep so yep. like if you forget about it and that's exactly what yeah. happened. It's not that I forgot about it. It's just, is that I forgot that Twitch did that. And I was like, yeah. God, I'm so slammed. I'm so slammed. I'll get to it. I'll get to it. And by the time I got to it, well, no, I downloaded a copy of it. But the downloaded copy of it was completely corrupted. Um, and right. I think what happened was my power shut off halfway through. Anyway, um, the point is I kept saying, I'll get another copy. I'll get another copy. I'll get to it. I'll get to it. And then it was gone. Yeah, it was uh, and you guys, you guys should have seen the staff chat. I was freaking out. <laughs> um but um, so we're going to keep that happening in, in, in the future by going back to YouTube. Now, the big announcement, the cool announcement, and if for some reason I'm wrong, you're going to cut this out. <laughs> no, this is going up tonight. We have a made, right. uh, we, we are confident enough in our ability to mod that we are going to allow a really big te- thing for all teams uh, next season, which is every team can select 1b2 from one of their players and change it we're making as we speak we're currently going through all the different b2s and we're making a list of generic average b2s things that aren't great things that aren't horrible things that are run-of-the-mill what you normally expect as average b2 to be and you will be able to take a b2 you do not like only one from only one person so not like one per person just one per team you can mm-hmm. trade that out for one of the B2s on the list. So that means if you're you know, Earth Defenders, you can finally get rid of Krillin's expanding energy wave and give him something that might actually do something. Yeah, you can get, get him Genocide Blast instead. Yeah. <laughs> if you, nah, if dude. You, if you, if you, no, no, no. If, give him a Trap Shooter, man. That's the best B2. It, it ends the line. game, dude. If you really if you really want a character to have a, a rush combo so that you can give them, so they can partake, uh, take better use of their clash bonuses, you can do that now. If you want to get rid of their rush combos and give them only beam, that's possible. So it's it's I think it's going to help a lot because there's a lot of teams out there that have that one player that just always throws out that B2 that sucks you can change that now. Um, and we think that'll be really exciting and really interesting. And hopefully you guys will too. Hashtag let, let Jero lift rocks. <laughs> let Jero lift rocks. I'm excited to see the dynamics of uh, how the AI changes because I, well, it's hard to say for certain. Actually, no, we've seen the AI adapt to changes before. I mean, they're, um, they, case they, in they point, have, they, nineteen and Jero. Yeah, so, don't forget Hercule and Patel with their kicks. That's true. They adapted really well. Um, so I'm I'm really really interested to see because it, it's it's more than just being able to change the move. Like there there will be things 
that change tendencies that will change in the AI itself. I don't know how big or small they will be, but it will change because the AI is built to adapt based on the move set it's given. Right. Um, mm-hmm. So that's interesting. And I, as someone who, you know, I don't know if it's a secret or not, but I'm a kind of a nerd about AI. Uh, also, I'm interested to see how that works out. Please, please keep in mind that this is a preliminary announcement. We're still working things out. I, I know we yeah, already we... said this, but we're still working things out. We're not entirely sure what the restrictions will be, if there will be any restrictions, what the final list will be, etc., etc., etc. So yeah. we'll, you'll get that information as it becomes available. Yeah. Correct. And also, all of the um, changes, including that, um, will be yes. announced at least after the upcoming bowl. Not immediately after... Upcoming bowl. Upcoming gauntlet. Um... <laughs> Not immediately after. We're, there's still some things we need to hash out, but any and all changes will be after that, not before that. Yeah, sometime yes. after the Gauntlet video, but sometime before the secret thing <laughs> that, that I've been throwing at the staff. Yeah. Mm, what could it be? We're going to play Smash, happening? guys. What? Yeah! <laughs> I'm hyped. Sorry, oh, I I just tune KO out. I don't know. It's right. not like he's trying to hide it from me. It's like he'd have to try to get me to pay attention. He only right. listens to me when I meme on burn. That's that's <laughs> why I have to do it so often. It's the only what time Squeeze listen to me. I was like, it's I was like, like who is this guy on our staff and why is he so wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean he's an admin? I mean it's fine, but and what is this profile picture? Right. Obviously, his character is oh, impeccable. God, I mean, look what he does to burn. <laughs> don't look at his profile picture. Do it. I spent good money on those. Yeah. This is also a safe for work. <laughs> you get off my Christian server. Um, oh, God. So I, I will think. Ban you. So I think so for a quick rundown. Uh, for the master list, just so that we have it before the end. TLR, uh, TLDR. Aurelia is on Dragon Ball Warriors. First, for, first form Zorban is not on uh, <laughs> on Derp. Android 16 is on Earth Defenders. Super 17 is staying FA only. We're not changing Ginyu Force's theme, and Frieza Soldier is not going to Ginyu Force. Yes. Yeah. That sounds here, great. here. And so. we're going to do retrials um, because while while the um, applications were good, there there were some cosmetic errors. And if you if you want to know what was wrong with your er- uh, wrong with your um, applications applications, you can ask one of us. I'm guessing Squee yeah. wants to talk to them, right? Yeah, Squee, you said that earlier, right? Well, yes, I'm I'm willing to find them to talk to him for that. Now, I think that one you can ask any of us. My my thing yeah. is more if you are angry about the decision and would yeah. like to discuss the decision itself, contact me. I'll be more than happy to go over it with you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll I'll just outright say what was wrong with it. Right, right, right. But any of us can let you know what yeah. would have disqualified yeah. it. So yeah, feel yeah. free to read because so... the 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 things that were. Uh, that disqualified the applications were things that would have disqualified things in the past that have disqualified applications in the past. So right, yeah. So with that, gentlemen, I I move to adjourn. Do do I have a second? Does anyone second sure. the motion? I'll third it. All right, secretary. Let it be noted that uh, the motion has been thirded. I don't know what that means. That's not actually a thing. But we have it's a been, secretary uh, now. So put it put it to the vote. Mm. I everyone say aye. Uh, no. Let's get the fuck out of here and go to bed. Yeah. Bye, everyone. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Thanks for listening. <laughs>